This is a Seven Palace Eatery. We are a brand that celebrates traditional South African food. What we have here is basically traditional South African food, um, coming more from uh, my side, being Kosa married Zulu. But I live in Cape Town, so I've got an influence of people all around uh, South Africa. The idea is to basically put one South Africa in a plate, and uh, we are big believers of the Rainbow Nation. Um, what we have today is a seven color plate, which is basically a plate that celebrates our traditional food. And the concept itself is a concept from the townships, uh, which describe your mom's Sunday's meal, which has variety and different colors. But what we've done with that, instead of using more Western ingredients, we've increased incorporated our traditional um, dishes and obviously there's a bit of color um, so I'll take you through what we have eh? so um, over here we have uh, chakalaka right uh, which is um, basically a spicy relish uh, onions peppers beans and a bit of chickpeas and um, so it's up to the chef how they like their chakalaka but the basic ingredients are uh, onions peppers uh, tomatoes and then you put uh, carrots and then the rest is up to the chef as I said and then we have umfino right umfino is a traditional South African pub commonly found in the rural areas it's basically pub your maize meal pub with wild spinach and it's one of my favorites because it's a dish that I grew up eating so ours has still got some spinach and some uh, herbs then we have ummosho. Ummosho is uh, also made out of uh, maize corn, uh, but not processed as much. And ours has just got a bit of some uh, peppers and a bit of herbs to give it a bit of flavor. Um, and then we have, uh, still warming up, beef stew. Uh, so that will be the meat aspect of the dish. So what we basically do, we dish up everything in one plate and add a couple of salads. This is a seven color plate, so there's no plate without a uh, seven color plate without pickled beetroot so this is a, a pickled beetroot and then that's just salsa also to add in a bit of color then the rooster breads and fat cooks so we've got a rooster bread here a rooster bread is basically bread that's made on an open fire very typical to south africa and then we've got a fat cook which is bread that's been deep fat fried so we can serve them as is or we can fill it with savory mince um, and chakalak And then we're gonna to top it up with some uh, chakalaka. Just to give it a little bit of a kick. And then this is the chakalaka that we're gonna put in here. All right. So this is a grill and with there's no South African meal without something on the fire. Sporty, it's basically a pot that you use on an open fire. Um, but because I'm about uh, colors, we decided to have colorful potties. They, when you cook your, um, your meat with that pot, they make it very tender and juicy. It falls off the bone. Thank you, Dada.